One of the great features of the new DJI A2 flight controller is that it has a built-in receiver. In this video I'll go over binding the A2 flight controller to your Futaba T14 SG. First we'll power up the flight controller, plug the USB cable into the LED module, and then into your computer. Start up the A2 Assistant software and make sure the receiver type is set to DR16. If it isn't, go to the RC tab and select DR16. Now you're ready to bind your transmitter to the A2. According to the A2 manual, this should be a simple four-step process. Turn on your receiver, power cycle the A2, press and hold the A2's link button for two seconds until the LED blinks red. If the bind or link is successful, the LED should turn solid green. But it doesn't, and it continues to show the glowing howl of failure. Twiddling the control shows no response in the assistant software. The trick is that you have to change the transmitter system type. To do this, go to the linkage menu, scroll down to the system menu, and change the system type to Fast Malt. After a few seconds, the A2 will see the transmitter and blink green. Press and hold the link button for two seconds. The A2 will bind with the transmitter and the LED will turn solid green. And operating the controls confirms that your transmitter is bound to the A2's receiver. That's it. Now you're ready to set up your radio and install the A2. For more multi-rotor videos, please subscribe to my channel and let me know in the comments what you'd like to learn next about the A2 flight controller.